What's happening YouTube? Mass Villain Gaming back here with yet another how-to video. This one's going to be how to use Nightbots, its custom commands, timers, and some other helpful tips to help you set up your stream like a baller son. So let's get right into the action. So what you're going to need to do is go to Nightbot and sign in using their login. Now there'll be links down below to go to all this stuff, so don't worry about it. So what you're going to need to do is log in using your Twitch handle and your Twitch password, and that will give Nightbot access to your account, from which you can do all types of fun stuff with Nightbot. And up first, we're going to be looking at the dashboard. Now the dashboard's got lots of cool things, lots of different pluses you can go, and lots of cool shit that you could do that you can all check out at a later time, but we're focusing on custom commands. So let's click on that and get right into it. So these are my custom commands. As you can see, I've amassed a few during my time on Twitch, which I'm sure you will too. Now I'm going to be showing you how to make these commands where the information I got comes from and then I'm going to be showing you how to make one and also set up some timers and some other cool stuff like I said at the start. But uh, in particular I'm going to be showing you one to set up which will show you the last five followers that followed you. As you can see I have one already set up for ten people with a wicked saying that will come up that Nightbot will show in your chat. So this is where you get it, it's the Wikipedia for Nightbot. So this page will show you how to set up your custom commands and some other really cool things that you can do with Nightbot. This is going to be used variables. Now variables are custom lines of text that you can put in and Nightbot can pull from other API addresses such as Steam, Xbox Live, PSN Network and some music playing networks as well. Now the thing that I'm going to be showing you today is the followers one that I have. So here's the command that we're looking for. And the next thing that we're going to need to do is just copy a chunk of this command and then go set it up yourself. So here's the part that you need to highlight. It's right after the sentence that you can put in. Just highlight the whole thing, right click on it, copy it, and now we're going to need to go back to our Nightbot custom commands page. Now up at the top right of the page you will see add new command. So what we're going to need to do is click on this and it's going to pop up a window. Now I named the command last five because what it's going to do is show you the last five followers that followed your channel. Now you're going to leave it to set up for whoever wants to put this command in. You can set it up so only you can put it in, only your mods, only your regulars, anyone who's in there, or really nobody at all. So what you're going to want to do now is just paste in the thing that we copied over on the variables chart. So paste it in and you're going to have to make a few changes. You're going to have to copy the word night, which is going to be your channel name. So just erase that and put in your channel name. So I put in Masked Villain Gaming because that's my channel name. And the rest is pretty much it. You can leave it as it is with the rest of the text as it is or you can change anything before the start of the command. Now this highlighted part here is the part that you can change. You can put in whatever you like. I just put in a little thing to say here is the last five people that followed. So all you have to do after that is go down to the bottom, hit command, and the command has been created. And now that our command's been put in, we're just going to go into our chat room. First make sure that Nightbot is actually in your room to make sure that this works since Nightbot is the one executing these commands. Just go into your chat and type in your command, exclamation point, last five, or whatever it is you named it. So as you can see, I put it in and bam, Nightbot puts it in. So this shows the last five people that followed your channel and you also know that it works. So this is a good little test to make sure that happens. So, now that we've learned how to make custom commands, let's learn how to set up a timer so that Nightbot will automatically input these commands for us and keep our viewers up to date. Now here is my list of timers and as you can see I've got quite a few going off at different times within my chat. So to set up a command like this inside of a timer, we're going to have to go back to our custom commands list and copy the command that we had just made. So let's go back over now to our custom commands list go down to custom commands and go down to the last five one that you had just made and just highlight the part inside the box as I am here. Right click on it, copy it and then go back to your timers tab. Now once you're back in your timers tab you're going to want to click add new timer. Now you can call it whatever you want because you're the only one that's going to see the name of the timer in your list. So I just call it followers. Now you're going to want to set up how often that Nightbot sets off this timer. The first thing you're going to want to set up is how often Nightbot checks 
for the number of lines that have passed. And you can set these two numbers to whatever you want to make the timer go off as often or as not often as you want. Now you can also put up commercials. I'm not sure why, but what we want to do now is a message. So just right click, paste in your followers command, hit add new timer, and you're done. You've created a brand new timer that will go off in your chat as often as you want it to be. Now let's go see if it works. So I just go back into my chat, input enough lines to make sure that the timer goes off, and as you can see, Nightbot inputs the timer, shows the command, and shows the last five followers that have followed my channel. So hopefully this helps you guys set up timers, and hopefully sets your channel up a little better and makes things a little easier on you. Now let's move on to some other helpful tips and tricks. Besides custom commands and timers, Nightbot has tons of cool features to help improve your stream and make things easier on you, the streamer. There's a frequently asked questions section, which I will be putting a link to in the description, which can show you many cool features and also maybe answer some questions that you may have. So make sure you check that out after watching this video. But while I'm here, let's take a look at a few quick sections now. First up will be the regular section. Now what making someone a regular does is bypass some of Nightbot's defenses, allowing them to do things like post links and input commands that would get a regular viewer timed out by Nightbot. Now before you add someone to this list, make sure you trust them completely, just in case. Now to add someone to this list, all you need to do is press the add new regular button and put in their Twitch name. For example, I am adding Placate Poetry to my list. And now that we have put in your name, just hit the add new regular button and we are done. Now Miss Playcay Poetry is free to post links and input commands at will without worrying about Nightbot timing her out. So the next feature we are going to look at are giveaways. Nightbot can facilitate a few different types of giveaways in your chat. As you can see, when we go to the giveaway tab, you will notice your channel's chat window here. From here you can watch as the giveaway proceeds. There are three types of giveaways. The first is the simple question and answer style. You can make up your own question and answer so it can be as easy or difficult as you want. The second is a random number giveaway. Here, Nightbot will choose a number between 1 and 100 and the people in your chat can guess as many times as they like. And the last type is the random active user giveaway. With this, Nightbot will choose an active member in your chat at random who have spoken in the last 10 minutes. Going back into the random number giveaway, we can see there are some options that we can choose from as to who is eligible for the giveaway. You can set these to anything from just mods, subs, regulars, or just normal users. You can also add people's Twitch name to disqualify them from entering the giveaway if you like. But this does not save, so you will have to re-input their names every time for every giveaway. So make sure you have some fun and give away some cool stuff. Your fans will surely appreciate it. The last section we're going to look at is spam protection. Now what this is going to do is prevent people in your chat from doing things you don't want them doing. Nightbot has quite an extensive list of do's and don'ts that you can set up, ranging from cap locks to even links. Depending on how you set up these things, you can do anything from time people out to even banning them. I myself don't use many of these spam protection features except for banning Rebecca Black emotes since she sucks. But go through this section and set it up to help protect yourself and your viewers. So that's going to wrap up this how-to video. If it helped you out, make sure to leave a thumbs up down below, rate, comment, and subscribe, and if you have any questions, feel free to comment down below. I'll see you guys next time with some more wicked how-tos. Have a good day. Peace.